Hi, I'm John Trainer, and I'm at the Haley and Steele Gallery with my paintings. I'm going to be talking about different ones so you can get an idea of why I painted them and get a feeling for uh, what, I, what I do on a normal day-to-day -day basis. So I'd like to start off with this painting here. I did this a few years ago in the winter in Rockport, Massachusetts, and it's a, a little different version of Rockport than uh, most people paint. It's from Atlantic Avenue and uh, it was done winter's day with some of the snow melting on the ground and some atmosphere in the air. But it's a beautiful spot. Now, this painting is called Vermont Farm in June and the painting was done in the studio from a study that was done outdoors. This farm is in an area of Stowe called Stowe Hollow. It's a farm I know well because I have done paintings of this farm since I was 16 years old. So this is a, a friend's property that I've painted uh, ever since I was a young man. Uh, it's very familiar to me and uh, it's one of my favorite spots to be in the world. This painting is called Sailing Away. It's done in a, the Tuileries Park in downtown Paris. There is a gentleman at this pond who rents boats and uh, the kids take them and they push them out into the water. Uh, so I did a, a series of paintings and this is one of, one of the paintings from that series. In this painting, the, the feeling of the, the light coming from over her shoulder and hitting in these spots here and here you know, the, the idea is to uh, create interest and keep the eye moving around in the painting as well as the structural composition. This is the painting of the waterfront in Boston. I painted this on location. Um, have some of the high rises and some of the buildings. And we have a little bit of the old and the new, the newer high rises, and then some old elements of the old waterfront area, some of the older style boats that uh, take people on tours around Boston. I, I really enjoy painting the reflections, and in this particular painting here, I've got what's above coming down and reflecting. Usually I, I make the reflections just a little bit darker than what they are reflecting. When I paint cityscapes, I try to make it a landscape. So I'm thinking about the same lighting situation, the same feeling of atmosphere. Uh, I'm trying to paint a cityscape as a landscape. The name of this painting is Lifting Fog, Martha's Vineyard and it's done in the little village of Menemsha. That's the village where the movie Jaws was filmed back in the 1970s. And if you go there, you'll see this boat. <laughs> it's, a, it's unmistakable uh, orange mast and dory on top of the boat. The, uh, it's a working little fishing village still today. It's, a, it's, another, it's a location where I could go and, and paint every day and find a, a different spot. I did this painting in, in the early morning when the fog was hadn't burned off yet. And I've got the uh, local fishermen in, in the boat. There's a lot of junk around and uh, you can put in foregrounds on this location, which is, makes it fun for an artist to paint. You can... outside on Newberry Street, painting a little town scene, some of the trees and buildings. Last time I painted outside, I was on a cliff in Ireland, so this is a little different. 